Okay, now that our audio is turned on, our video is on if you're using it, we are sharing our desktop hosting applications and we are in the default layout. We're ready to begin recording. Okay, again, make sure you've checked all of those things. Audio, video, hosting applications, and default layout. Now we are ready to go. All we have to do is click on the record button. We're going to click OK to start or resume our recording. Then we're just going to we're going to mem minimize this eliminate window and we're going to go to our instructional resources whether it's a PowerPoint you can just speak to your PowerPoint if you're using your pen or, uh, or Windows journal you can use your uh, pointer and draw on your screen everything you do is going to be recorded okay now let's say you have to handle some type of um, disruption in your classroom if you're teaching live in the classroom or recording or let's say you just have to take a break go to the bathroom whatever it might be pull up your illuminate interface real quick and click on this pause stop button and then click OK recording stopped. okay now you can go um, handle uh, a, a disruption or take a break whatever you have to do when you're ready to resume, just click on the record icon again and resume your recording. Recording started. Okay, feel free to use that pause button as many times as you have to. Unfortunately, with Illuminate, you get one shot at this. You either use it or it's just uh, basically a wasted recording. So if you do need to handle uh, stops or breaks in your recording, just use pause. Okay. Now when you're all done, finish with your recording, go ahead and click that stop pause button one more time. Click OK. Recording stopped. And then you can exit Illuminate.